Yo, 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 welcome back, welcome back. Ladies and gentlemen, it is your boy Mate Ben Mello coming to you back live with more Overwatch 2. We're taking a look at the Behind the Hero, Iviari, Overwatch 2 Invasion. Let's go and take a look. A lot of research went into the culture. All the inspiration came from doing studies about Peru and the culture there. We also had cultural specialists that helped us a lot uh, in this journey as well. Yes, so really excited to talk to you all about Iliari, and my name is Piero Herrera. I am a senior hero designer here on Overwatch. I am half Brazilian, half Peruvian. It is my honor to be the designer that essentially designed the abilities for Iliari and the gameplay. Uh, I came to Blizzard two years ago. My pitch to actually come to Blizzard was to make a Peruvian character, right? And uh, the pitch was uh, essentially somebody with some powers uh, from Peru. So a lot of research went into uh, the culture and um, really just tried to incorporate a lot of it on the animations, for example, right? Uh, so you can see that she has two braids, which is a really popular hairstyle for women in Peru, which actually reminded my grandmother, for example, you know, Peruvian textiles, which Peru is really known for, the clothing which can see on the model itself uh, when she does her shift ability which uh, is the the outburst ability she really shows off the cape on a we really wanted to find somebody that uh, represented both uh, Peruvian Spanish and Kashra as well as the voice actress Hola que tal como esta mi nombre es Andre yo soy la actriz detrás de la voz de Iliari la última hija del sol Yo grabé la voz de Iliari tanto en inglés como en español y en quechua. Pues ahorita estamos en la Casa de la Cultura Criolla, es una casa museo y me gusta mucho este lugar porque me representa la cultura en la cual yo he crecido, yo nací y crecí aquí en Lima, Perú, en la capital. En Blizzard estaban buscando una actriz que pudiera dar la voz en ambos idiomas. Yo tengo fluidez con el inglés y también, bueno, el castellano, el español, que es mi idioma madre, entonces pude tener la oportunidad de ser elegida para el rol de Iliari justamente porque tenía esta flexibilidad de poder hablar ambos idiomas y, claro, y también poder eh, hablar el quechua para aportarle al personaje y poderle dar este aire de representación peruana en el mundo de Overwatch 2. Para mí es importante tener visibilidad con el idioma quechua porque en Perú se hablan diferentes quechuas, hay más de 14 diferentes tipos de quechua alrededor del, del país. Entonces fue súper chévere poder encontrar pequeños detalles de la cultura peruana, no solamente la voz, sino en los trajes. Pude reconocer la forma del, del tumi en el arma de Yari, que es un cuchillo ceremonial que se usaba en la cultura inca. My name is Felipe Pereira and I'm a sound designer for Iliari. There were a couple of things that I took into consideration. One is that she has this like golden <coughs> orb of sun energy that she uses for basically everything. So I knew that I wanted something that was tonal. I want to make something that sounds like an aggressive sun, a really strong force. And I also wanted to sneak in something that ties with Peru in her kit. So that's why I ended up using Peruvian instruments basically as the source. It's like a cana flute, pan flute, ocarina, and maracas. And those are the instruments that I recorded in a bunch of different like weird ways that ended up being the solar energy. <laughs> Our team is quite diverse, so I think everyone kind of like appreciates um, representation in Overwatch. I think it's a big part of what we do. That is part of the reason why I recorded a can of flute to make solar sounds, right? Because like, I probably didn't have to do this, but like, wouldn't it be cool? Like, wouldn't it be cool to make, you know, this into that and to show that like we care and to show that like we want to make something unique and that like belongs to that culture. So 
yeah, for me, it's just so happy to be able to represent South America a lot more in this game, which is such a huge game and it has such a worldwide audience. Uh, and now with Iliari's release, uh, she's such a popular character, right? Like, and having a South American hero that is that popular on the support roster on Overwatch, that really just warms my heart uh, to the core, really. Un videojuego que tiene tanto gran alcance y que es tan popular como Overwatch que tenga la representación de poder usar el quechua en una heroína y que está teniendo todo este bonito recibimiento significa mucho, al menos para mí como peruana significa muchísimo, es parte de mi identidad y ahora lo puedo ver reflejado en una de superheroína como Iliari. Un mensaje en quechua al Iliancho Mashikuna Mashikuna Nyohakani Andre, Piru Takismikani, Iliari Tan Rimai Kachini, Paihaja Pajwarmin, eh, videojuego Overwatch 2 Blizzard P eh, Ricurini Dope Dope Dope, 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 dope Always, always fantastic to find out the origins of these different characters always and Iliari is quite literally very popular like every match there has been an Iliari on every team like whether it's my team or it's the opponent's team it you, I probably maybe once or twice I have not seen a team with Iliari on it that, that's how popular she is like they're trying to figure it out figure it out I am myself like I'm am looking for a third support healer type and you know i'm in training with iliari right now i tried it one time i won one lost one like horribly but you know learning so yeah she's definitely a great character love it so appreciate you guys tuning in don't forget to like comment subscribe to your boy appreciate you you guys have a wonderful wonderful day peace